Trash bags and containers have their set out space. You don't want to see construction debris, old mattresses, a ripped down fence at this state lot has turned it into a dump. Cleaning up spaces is going to get more difficult. Washing machines usually help keep things clean. When somebody abandons part of the appliance in the middle of the street, it only adds to the dirty conditions. This is West Farms Road at the Cross Bronx Expressway. It's just growing, growing fast. Roe Andrade has lived in the West Farms neighborhood for a decade. She walks around past the new apartment buildings and school. This stretch is not a site she wants to see. It regularly needs to have maintenance on it and the garbage just tumbles in. It has a wind, like a wind funnel that goes from the highways because it's elevated and pollution just constantly rolls floatable trash and litter right into the river on the east side and right down here on the sidewalk on the west side. The city tells me the lot along the expressway is state land. Sidewalks and streets are managed by the New York City Department of Sanitation, which sent out an inspector to take a look. Don't forget the washing machine. This neighbor hopes for a more long-term solution. I want them to take serious a request to be able to create at least roadside habitat so that we can create pollinator buffers, sound buffers, um, and something that might create a litter, inhibit litter. She says she has been in contact with the state about a cleanup project at the lot and suggests a community garden. There are new trees on a new section that's more maintained along the main road. I want an environmental justice policy now. That way we can see more lands protections, uh, more conservation. The City Department of Sanitation says this is a known illegal dumping site. They've already been out here six times since the summer. The State Department of Transportation, which manages the lot, says they'll get it cleaned up.